So, nagiging busy ako. But those are good problems. Just keep inquiry. I'll be happy to assist you. So, for our... Ang dami ko sinasabi, di ba? So, for our first-time viewers, my name is Bisetti. I'm a real estate agent here in the Philippines. And for today's episode, I'm gonna be touring this unit behind me. Na, na vlog ko na to. I'm gonna put the link over here nung bare look nito. And now, what I'm about to show you is a cozy minimalist design. And it's super duper nice. Ngayon, huwag na natin patagal ito. Let's go ahead and start. So, as we enter to this unit, ayan, dahan-dahan tayo. Ang ganda, right? So, let me close this. Sinara ko para hindi tayo makagambala ng mga kapitbahay. Diba? Ang ganda. So, yeah, let's go ahead and start. Even me, speechless lang. So, as we enter to the unit, by the way, before we start this unit uh, for our first-time viewers, this is located in Uptown Park Suites Tower 2. This is a total of 75.50 square meters, two-bedroom unit. This is facing the west side. Now, let's go ahead and start the tour. But before that, I know, I know, even me, I super miss this line. Are you guys ready? Am I ready? Let's go. We're already here. So let's go ahead and start. Now, as we enter to this unit, over here, you see like a side table. This was actually not included in the original plan, but my client suggested to have this kind of table here, sa entryway. This side table, this can also serve as a buffet table, which makes sense, di ba? Ang galing ng idea na yun. And over here, as what you can see, this is the intercom. For our first time viewers, this is connected to the lobby. So every time you have visitors, you can see them from here. So as what you can see, nag blend in yung ating intercom. Hindi mo siya agad man notice. Before we check the dining and the living area, let's check first. My favorite part. Well, actually, lahat to favorite ko. Lahat. Or itong unit na to is my favorite. No joke. For the kitchen, look at this kitchen. Grabe. Pwede akong umikot-ikot. And as what you can see, lahat pinalitan. Even the flooring. The flooring, it, it was changed. So originally, it was just like a ceramic tiles. And they changed it to a wood planks. Now, let's focus on the kitchen. So from this one, the original was a granite countertop. So they changed it to, um, I think this is marble. Marble stone. I forgot to ask. Also, the cabinets were changed. So bigger and better cabinets and also soft closed cabinets na siya. there and also the sink so for the sink they also make it a uh, bigger single sink because the original one it's super small super cute size and i'm glad that they changed it too and this one is a pull out faucet super nice right now as we continue Diba? Look at that. Even the cabinets are super nice. By the way, all the cabinets, this under and um, over counter cabinets, were changed. So basically, lahat. Buong kitchen na cabinets tinanggal, pinalitan. So brand new. All of these are brand new. Now, this unit comes with this, uh, this range hood as well as the original one was an electric stove. But the designer decided to 
change it to induction and also this one was retained this is an oven which is already part of the deliverables and yeah and there's also like cove lightings over here which gives it a super nice look the combination of the colors wala akong masabi this are all my favorite colors well hindi naman masyadong halata i always wear black that's my favorite color so over here is the of course Kita nyo naman, the fridge. Also, there's like a water dispenser. This is uh, 2 liters. Yes, 2 liters water. 2 liter water dispenser and a bottom freezer. So, <laughs> now to continue. Over here, so there's like a door. I know you know this door. So, this is uh, the maid's quarter. But for the maid's quarter, since my client decided to... Uh, Use this room as a pantry slash washing area slash storage area. So basically, they're gonna put like a stackable um, washing washer and dryer over here. So this will be installed next week pa. So that's the reason why I cannot show it to you yet. But you have an idea that washer and dryer can fit in this area. And over here, there are cabinets there. Your storage. You can actually put a lot of stuff in here. Yon is another cabinet which I cannot open because may nakaharang na mabigat na dryer. So, and also I know I mentioned that this is slash pantry, and you might be wondering nasan siya. So, it's over here. This is the pantry area, diba? So now. Let's go ahead and continue the tour. Medyo mahaba pa to, but I hope you guys are enjoying as much as I am. I might be like telling things na mali yung term ko. Just correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not an interior designer. So, there. Now, as we continue the tour, this is the dining area. So, as what you can see for the dining area, Maluwag. It's it's super spacious. So even if we actually did not expect that a six-seater dining set can fit in here. We were only thinking like four because when we visited this place, my client and I were asking, Kasha kaya ang six? But this is a six-seater dining set. And even if it's a six-seater dining set, it doesn't look crowded in here. It's still spacious. Oh, diba? One, two, three. Tatlo pa. Hindi kayo magkahabangaan ng makakasalubong sa area na to. Even if there is like a six-seater dining set. So it was really planned well. Super ganda. And aside from that, there is this wood wall panels over here. Ang ganda. Super ganda. And the secret kung bakit it, it looks like spacious is this mirror. Iba talaga nagagawa ng mga mirrors. So now, as we continue the tour, we're now... Oh, by the way, before we proceed, sorry, ang gulo ko, diba? But I wanna show you this. This one. This light accent, it actually gives perfect look of the dining area. So now to continue the tour, over here is your living area and as what you can see, sobrang cozy. Parang gusto mo nalang maupo manood ng Netflix. Like, kung hindi ako nagtatrabaho, hindi ako nag-vlog right now, siguro makikinood na lang ako ng Netflix. Joke lang. So now, what I like about this living area, first is this one. As what you can see, there's like a mirror, you know? There's a mirror over here, which actually makes sense because if you enter the living area, it doesn't look crowded. Para siyang malaki. Nakadagdag yun kasi parang akala mo ang laki, diba? Ang galing, galing. Hindi na sayang tong space na to. This is a 55-inch um, television. And the reason why um, they only put like a 55-inch television is because the designer um, told my client na masasayang kasi yung wall accent if matatakpan siya ng malaking TV. And aside from that, another factor is you have here your three-seater sofa which is hindi naman siya ganun kalayo so 55 inches is the ideal size for this living area there's like a side table over there tapos there's accent center table over here and napansin niyo ba yan? It was like hidden over there. Hindi ko siya napansin. Like when you enter the unit, hindi mo siya agad makikita. So it's not an eyesore. Now as we continue, 
So there's like more cabinets over here. So the color that was used here is just the same from the kitchen cabinet. There's like a um, side table floor lamp over here. And aside from the side table floor lamp, there is like an accent here, which is a wood stool to complete the look of this side. And of course, over here, you can never go wrong by putting a plant. Naga siya ng buhay. And aside from that, there's like another mirror here. That is actually the magic of like putting a mirror. Pero not too much. Because if it's too much, pangat siya tingnan. Now for this one, marami ring wood panels but it doesn't look too much. You know what is too much, ba? Diba? So over here, this is the access to the balconies. Since gabi nga tayo ng vlog, Wala tayong makikita sa labas, but this is... Tada! Oh, mali. Okay. <laughs> so this is the balcony. So again, the view of this unit, that's um, the Mitsukoshi Mall. If you go here, naka-on yung AC ha, but... Diba? Wala kang naririnig na ingay nung compressor. I mean, so yon. That's Mitsukoshi Mall and I believe that's gonna be turned over soon. So uh, that's gonna be like full of lights. Nakikita nyo yan? That's Grand Hyatt. So magiging ganyan din yan kamaila over here. And once it's turned over, ang ganda na rin ang view mo, diba? Now, enough with the balcony because nothing much in here. So, lock natin. Baka makalimutan. Now, let's continue the tour. So, over here, this is your way to your bedrooms and your common toilet and bath. But before we check that, as what you can see, there are bar stools here. So of course, syempre naka bar type kitchen tayo. Hindi naman kompleto kung wala tayong bar stools. So there are total of one, two, three bar stools. And again, ang ganda nitong accent na to. Lakas makasosyal. Diba? Ang ganda. It's super nice. And there's another here. As what you notice, there is another wood panels over here. Another accent. The interior designer also told me that he usually leaves a painting sa mga bahay or condo na dinedesign niya. This is the personal touch daw. He paints, he designs, so lahat na ata. Napaka-talented talaga. So now let's continue the tour. We'll go ahead and check the first bedroom since ito na yung malapit sa akin. So now let's go ahead and check it out. Here. Ang ganda. I mean, this is just the first bedroom. Oh, and by the way, I think you might be wondering... Sinabi ko bedroom, diba? So yeah, this is supposedly the first bedroom, but my client requested for it just to be the office slash guest room. Now, this sofa, this is actually a pull-out sofa. So if you have guests, pwede mo siya convert to uh, a bed. But if you don't have guests, you could just put it like that. Hindi ko na siya gagawin. But it's just like the standard sofa beds na nakikita niyo sa internet. And over here... Which is my favorite part of this bedroom is this. This is super nice. Ooh! This is super nice. Hindi lang abot yung pa ako sa floor, but <laughs> hindi abot. But I think na adjust naman siya, but which I'm not gonna do. And this are shelf over here with cove lighting, and again another wood panels over here to complete the look of this side and more drawers over here soft closed and now the designer also told me na ayaw niyang sayangin lahat ng space and that's the reason why over here minaximize nga he actually put like a uh, bookshelves over here and this is again ang galing oh wait cabinet. So yeah, ang galing, ba? At first, you think na parang design lang siya, but it's functional. Cabinets. It has a very unique layout. If you don't have the talent, hindi mo mamamaximize yung space ng ganito kaganda. It's because since it's unique nga, you need a talented mind to decorate or to lay out this first bedroom. But if you notice, yan o, ah, layo ka pa ng konti. So as what you can see, Sobrang na-maximize ngayong space. This is two-seater sofa. 
and you also have here like a side table coffee table and your view is just the same from the balcony of course the mitsukoshi mall which is madilim pa because it's not yet turned over and over here um there is a cabinet here a sliding cabinet so again which makes sense sliding cabinet shop and at least over this part kasi, um, it's too narrow, so bright idea ang paglagay ng sliding cabinet. With mirror, again, mirror, kasi it, para it, it would look spacious. And another, here, there is another wood accent. Yeah, wood, and this is another painting of the designer. Alright, so there, let's go ahead and continue the tour dahil marami pang doors. Joke, dalawa na lang. <laughs> so now, as we continue the tour, before we check this master bedroom, let's go ahead and check first the common toilet and, common toilet and bath. Are you guys ready? Ta-da! So the combination used for this toilet and bath is color black as what you can see black white wood accent which looks super clean and over here oh wow there's an enclosure our favorite enclosure there's already an enclosure here and then a door na to, ha, in fairness that was over here there's our shower you have a rain and hand shower and a super nice day it's matte black, my favorite color. This is also where you can put your body wash, your conditioner, your shampoo, and wow, oh, galing, ang galing. The floor and this are the same. Wow, may wala na pansin. Ang galing, ang galing lang, wow, wow lang. <laughs> galing. So anyway, this is at first look. Maliit tong toilet and bath talaga ng unit na to. I, I really have to be honest. But like right now, it's super different. It looks bigger. Wala naman na change the size, but it's bigger. And I think the reason behind that is because the choice of colors, the choice of like yung color matching nito, itong toilet and bath na to. My gosh, grabe, ang galing ng designer. So anyway, there is also like a towel bar over here, which is not ideal for my height. So, brown taas. But then again, this is not my unit. So, I would ko pala siya, pero so brown taas. So, we towel bar over here. Medyo talagang naka extend na yung kamay ko. So, now, let's go ahead and continue the tour and off with the toilet and bath. Let's go ahead and check the master bedroom. Welcome. It's super duper nice. Kanina pa ako ikot na ikot. So, this is super duper nice. Look at this. This is the wood wall accent. Still the same from the wood panel accents that we have sa labas ng bedroom na to. And this is a queen size bed. And another 55 inch television over here. And ang ating mga cabinets are also here. So basically, as what you can see, the colors of the cabinets for the bedrooms, the living area, as well as the toilet and bath are just the same. Kitchen. So same lang siya. And over here is your vanity, your vanity mirrors over here, slash study table, where you can even do your makeup here with all these cabinets again and for this one this is your cabinet so over here your cabinets are gonna be here wow this one yeah right? so it's a spacious cabinet over here yeah that was super ganda and the view of this unit is just gonna be the same from the living. Yung madilim natin na Mitsukoshi Mall because hindi pa nga siya turn over. So there! Oh, I forgot to mention that most of the furniture, or actually I think almost lahat ng furniture um, for this unit 
was custom made. That's very important because you have to make sure that the size of each furniture are actually accurate dun sa size na paglalagyan ninyo. Because sometimes, yung mga nabibili natin sa stores are it could be bigger, it could be smaller, so it's very important for you to custom made your furniture, most especially if you have like a tricky or a unique layout, it's very important. So even these bar stools, this is a custom made. The bed, the sofa, lahat. Yeah, I cannot, like, I'm checking if meron. Even this dining set, ha? This dining set, this sofa, uh, these chairs are also custom made. The table, custom made. Lahat. Which makes sense, right? Because the spacing of this area is well planned. Hindi siya masikip. Which is super nice. Again, iba talaga yung talent ng mga interior designer. There are lots of spaces na hindi mo may iisap kung anong pwedeng ilagay, kung paano mo siya i-decorate. And that's the reason why you pay for them. You ask for their help. So, that's it. Ngayon, the ang ganda? Even me, I was super speechless the first time I saw this unit. It's my favorite. Not being diet. So, if you also need help designing your house, designing your condo unit, don't hesitate to call or text me. I can refer you to the interior designer who's my good friend. Oh, but then again, I'm a real estate agent. I should be selling the unit. So... This unit, the same exact unit, of course, this is not for sale, but we have few units left in Uptown Park Suites. We also have similar cut available and other like square type layout, one, two, three, penthouses. If you need help purchasing a condo here in the Philippines, I'll be able to help you, not just condo, houses, lahat ng property, house and lot, lots lang, farm, lahat. Tinibenta ko na. So, <laughs> I'm selling everything if you need help. So, even if you're outside the Philippines, I can still help you. Don't hesitate to call, to text, or email me. My number, by the way, is registered to Viber, WhatsApp, Line, Telegram, iMessage. You can even FaceTime audio me or FaceTime video me. I'll be happy to assist. If you might be wondering the price of the interior design, unfortunately, that's something I cannot disclose. It's gonna be the interior designer who will be discussing the price. If you want to get the same layout as this it ranges around 18 to 20 million to purchase like a two bedroom unit here so that depends on the size so once again my name is Bisetti you guys can call me B for short I know medyo lahat ng mga inquiries na nakuha ko na kayo sa first name ko you can just call me B close naman tayo and thank you so much for watching I hope to see you again in my next vlog I'll try to be consistent I'll see you again soon. Bye!